Mm. Oh, well, hello there. It's Persian New Year, and it's been a tough year. As you know, the pandemic has shut down everything, but we are going to keep the traditions alive virtually. Then next year, we hope to do this all over again, but in person. With that said, my name is Kayvon, and as many of you know, I am by far the most famous half Persian comedian in the world. And it's not easy being half Persian, let me tell you, because people don't expect me to know anything about Iran. But I will tell you this, Baba Iruni, Maman Amrikai. For those of you who don't know, that means my dad is Iranian and my mom is regular American. No extra flavors. With that said, it's time to learn a little bit about Persian New Year. And it's important I tell you my journey in regards to Nowruz so that you can see how I've kept the tradition alive myself. You see, my father, Iraj, never taught me about Nowruz. Growing up, I did not even know it was a thing. You're saying, Kayvon, how is that possible? You're the most famous half Persian comedian. How did you not know about Nowruz? Well, the reason is I was raised in Reno, Nevada. There were no other Iranians, not a lot of people celebrating Nowruz there. I mean, this wasn't exactly Irvine, okay? With that said, at the age of 25, I learned about Nowruz for the very first time. I realized kids get money, gifts, and brand new clothes. Now I know why my dad didn't tell me about it. That's okay. I decided to make up for lost time. I started going to every single Nowruz party I could as a comedian. He's perfect. I didn't know Haji Firuz wore Cornell sweatpants all these years. That's fantastic. School spirit. School spirit. Go take a seat, Haji Firuz. That's how we do it. We have lots of fun. We have lots of different characters. And we have costumes. I'm Haji Firuz, and I'm wearing this outfit because they said, OK, so there's this funny red guy that makes people laugh. And who wants to be him? Oh, I'll be him. And I don't even really know anything about Persian culture too much yet. I'm Brazilian. I'm not even Persian. <laughs> But, uh, hey, culture is fun. <laughs> okay, I didn't even know a lot about Amunoruz before planning this event because um, the icon of our event is Haji Firuz, and apparently Amunoruz is just a friend of Haji. <laughs> I'm an old guy that loves to make people yeah, happy, he, and give them candy, and let the kids get candy, and have them all dancing and be he happy. He gives out AD, he gives out like gold coins and things like that, so he's Haji Firuz's partner in crime, but not as popular as Haji Firuz. So we thought Still, we people love me though because I make them dance and I make them happy. I told jokes, I danced, I ate, I had a great time, but more importantly, I learned about the traditions of the ancient holiday, Nowruz, AKA Persian New Year. What I didn't know is over 300 million people celebrated it around the world and still do. I know Americans don't go to other countries and celebrate our independence. Is that what it is? New Year's. <laughs> The Persians uh, in southwestern Iran are the first known people to have celebrated it. Now, Rose is such a big part of Afghan culture that's just interlaced in the culture and the fabrics of Afghanistan's history. The Indians have no rules. And I'm from Kazakhstan. Uh, our culture also celebrates Nowruz. The Republic of Azerbaijan, in you know, Uzbekistan, Afghanistan, and Tajikistan. All of these places celebrate this, and it's a really a spring festival. How did I not hear about it? So if you're a little shaky on what Nowruz is all about, I'm the perfect guy for you. We're gonna learn about it together. 